So we've got the water filter out and as you can see absolutely full of crap. It's like plastic swarf to me. Yeah, which is what we were told probably was. So we'll see if that helps. And here we go. As you can see, all little bits of crap. It's plastic swarf where they've cut the uh, tanks. Yeah, absolutely full of it. So that's certainly not going to help. All inside there, which you can't really it's see. Got, I don't know. Look at that. Yeah. Mental. Right. We'll give that a good clean and see if that helps. So we removed the filter, and as you can see, they are just push connect connectors. And this is, by the way, if people are saying we're ruining warranty, we've had a couple of negative yeah. comments like that. Eldis. Brown Hills themselves, Brown Hills have told the service to department said to us, if you're capable, this is what you should do mm -hmm. to try it. App so. Apparently it does say... This is a service item, apparently. Yeah, and it, and it is an item that they recommend that you do personally. You know, they're not saying you can't do. So, so we didn't film taking it off, unfortunately. No. It's, it's in that orientation. I've obviously had to remove my, my wood. We're going to leave it off temporarily so that we can periodically check this because we think we're going to have to flush the system two or three times. Mm -hmm. But you can see how it how it sits. These are just push connectors. Just bring the just bring the two the pieces out, and then just show show the viewer. How they work. <laughs> it, it is as simple as these are on a quick release. On on the, you have to push them. You have to push back them back away from. Well, I'm so, not going. I'm not going to do it now. Why? All right, I'll do it now. They push in like that, and they they're locked. And then to remove them, you just push the edge back. And then it's a little bit fiddly. It is probably a two-person job. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> there you it's go. that easy. I I still marvel at how these don't leak, but there you go. I mean, I I use them all the time in engineering, but more for um, air pneumatics rather than water. But it still does go. the same thing. So we're going to put that back together, prime the system, and periodically check it over the next few weeks and see if it solves our problem. As we've Oops, said before, you know, I'll turn the light off. As we've said before, it is going back to Eldis for rectification. Well, Brown Hills. I keep saying Eldis, but you know what I mean. For rectification anyway, if we can't solve the problem. But certainly yes. that swarf was not helping. Yeah. And I'd imagine... The like say, what was the Brown Hills guy very, very helpful on the phone? He said, Give it a go and see what it's like inside. And like I say, as soon as we opened it up, you could see the bits inside yeah, it. Yeah, yeah, so, okay. Let's put that back together. I've already pushed this one in, as we've just showed you. It literally is as easy as pushing the connections on, pushing it back into the actual pump itself. That. And then just pulling it back on itself and yeah, making sure just that to it's, make sure tight. it's locked we'll obviously check before we do anything that we haven't got a leak but they are pretty non-serviceable yeah it's just a drip from the pump obviously because we've had the pump out uh, make just make sure that like you've you've fully emptied the system before you do yeah, this yeah, folks right away, yeah. we, we have already done that <laughs> yeah. otherwise you're in for a shower yeah it should be okay right. we'll check that now okay You know, can actually see that there's a tiny bubble in there. What I'm trying to do is I'm trying to actually video. Oh, there we go. There we go. And it's done it for me. <laughs> that's what I was trying to video. Um, that's What was that at 20 seconds? Like I say, it hasn't stopped it. But at least we now know that it's clear. What I would say to anybody, if you do do this... We couldn't get ours to, it wouldn't prime again. So what we actually did was, we actually turned this pipe so that it was, because this is the inlet pipe, and that's going in, and then that's going, that's, that, that will, obviously all of your bits go into there, and the, the filter goes through to the centre and into the pump. And what we found was that you could actually see the water was halfway. So we lifted that 
which it, it actually helped to push the air through. But like I say, you can see a tiny little bubble. It has done it once. Oh, it's done it. You've yeah. got it on film. No. As long as you've got it, that's fine because you could sit here for five minutes and wait for it to do it again. Although if you send me the footage, I can speed it up. You speed it up. There you there go. We go. <laughs> So that was uh, one minute and 20 seconds between um, pulses there. Which is fine in the day. You could put up with it. It's not hurting anything. But you don't want that while you're asleep. No. So we're still going to have to turn it off to go to bed at night. Yeah. So...